Travis. Uh, Kendall Kalp wrote an article today in the Sikkim365.com premium section, and the article was this, based on the decision from Adam Flagler. He said, if Flagler returns, Baylor is the clear Big 12 favorite. Ahead of Kansas? Well, I mean, we talked about this before the show, before you got here, Smokey, and, you know, Kansas, look, Christian Brown staying in the draft. We haven't heard about Jalen Wilson yet. I guess it got to the end of the day today, right? Yeah, I believe yeah. it. I believe that today end of the is day the day today. Uh, now, look, there are probably Kansas is probably going to get Tyrese Hunter from Iowa State. So that would be Tyrese Hunter and Kevin McCuller uh, in the transfer That's portal. That's pretty damn salty. Uh, they've got the kid that they that they got from I want to say like Southern Illinois or wherever he came from last year. That's uh, that can score. Of course, they're going to have big time recruits. They're coming off a national championship. But uh, Baylor has more sure things probably right now than Kansas. But clear to me would would maybe make it tough. I mean, that's that's. I don't know if they're head and shoulders above Kansas, but I think you have more sure things when you get Flagler, Cryer. Uh, you know, Thamba, all those guys back, plus your transfers in, uh, and, and then, the, you know, one of the top recruits and, in the country. And Tyrese you know, Hunter's can't. not a given. No. That's not a given because Texas is in play there, or maybe somebody else is as well. And, of course, out there still waiting is uh, Matthew Meyer, former Baylor star, uh, a part of the national championship team, and what he ends up doing uh, as well as he said he's going back to play college basketball. It's just a matter of who and when will get his ta- who will get his talents and when he makes that decision as well. Now, 